The Greensboro Swarm took time out of their schedule today to spend some time with some very eager young learners. That's right. WFMY News 2's Jalen Gilkey was at Staley Early Learning Center for all the fun. Yeah, the 13 young men on the Greensboro Swarm roster are used to putting on a show for hundreds or maybe even thousands of fans at a time on the basketball court. But today, those young men showed off some of their other talents, including arts and crafts, dancing, reading, and just having fun as they spent the morning with students over at Staley Early Learning Center in High Point where kids ranging from ages one to four years old got to hang out and bond with some of the best athletes in the world. But if you ask the players, today was more special to them than it could ever be for the kids. It's big, you know, just to come show face to the kids and then the kids come up to you and just give you a big old hug because you cut you tall and play basketball. Man, that's a, such a great feeling and then uh, it brings so much joy because they have so much joy, you know, so it's, it's a great, great experience. You know, every day we're competing against grown men every day uh, and every, everyone's goal is to try to get to the NBA. But to have a day like this where you just relax, be with the kids and just bring, just bring everything in perspective, you know, it's, uh, it's a great, it's a great time. And although the kids may be too young to realize or really understand what's going on, the staff over at Staley Early Learning fully understands what events like this means. This is a very uplifting um, activity this, and, and partnership all together. Our staff appreciate the recognition for the work that they do in the community. Our parents uh, enjoy seeing their children engaged with the players um, and it, it genuinely brings joy to, to all of us. Now the Swarm are headed for a four game road trip and your next chance to catch them at home over at the Greensboro Coliseum Fieldhouse will be on February 2nd as the Windy City Bulls make their way 